What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy Hunter X here, bringing us another episode of Project Equivalence. Hope you're all having a fantastic day. Wait, with that being said, if you're new around here, click that subscribe button as we're trying to get to 250 subscribers. With that being said, let's get into today's episode. Alrighty, guys, you might have you might notice a little something different here. Uh, yeah, I have 1.2 1.29 billion EMC. You might be wondering why. Well, let's just say I cleared out our Thomcraft area. Yeah, this used to be full of diamond blocks. Oh, there's a couple remaining. Uh, yeah, this used to be filled with diamond blocks. So I um, yeah, I I kind of mined it out a little bit. <laughs> Also, you might notice, um, yeah, uh, my pickaxe is not taking durability. So with me doing all this clearing, I was able to make my pickaxe unbreakable and also add some modifiers onto it. So that's pretty, um, that's pretty neat. So I think what I want to do is on camera, I also want to add a couple of modifiers as well, uh, AKA, um, we're gonna add more redstone, but we're also gonna add some fortune on, which I believe we can get to fortune three. Yeah, now we have fortune three. So I guess our next modifiers are just gonna be speed, to be honest. Um, I wasn't expecting to be able to get fortune three like right away. So yeah, we're at, uh, uh, I can't see the level. Let's go put it back in the, the, the forgery real quick. So we have a uh, tier two of the thing and we have a mining speed of 16.64, which is pretty fucking fast. But yeah, so I designed this Thomcraft area. By the way, did we, all right, we've already got our Necronomicon and things. So let's go ahead and go back to our Thomcraft area. This is where we're going to be doing a lot of our Thommy craft uh, work and maybe even a little bit of a Tanya uh, uh, just for the Gaia Guardian fight. Which we're going to go ahead and need. Okay, uh, a large area for. So let's go ahead and I believe... Do I have it on me? Uh, I don't think I have it on me. I should, in theory, have it. Yep. Hey. 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 Give me that back. That's not where I wanted to go. I wanted to go here. And slap that right there. Perfect. So the next item that we're going to need is something called a thomic meter. Is that what it's called? This thing. The thomo meter is what we're going to need. So we're going to go ahead and need electrum and some mana glass. So electrum again is uh, fairly easy. So we're going to go ahead and take some gold. Uh, I'm going to do, uh, actually, I'm going to do, like, a full, like, 8,000, because, yeah, we're going to need quite a bit of Electrum. I'm just going to reset my, my smeltery controller thing here, and we're going to go ahead and, uh, hook up, actually, I don't even know if I can, I can only hold 4,000. Uh, all right. So I guess we'll be doing a little bit of expanding. And actually, you know what? I'm going to start cooking silver. And what I'm going to do is you're going to make a locks for me. Uh, oh. 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 
So you're going to be making blocks of Electrum. Uh, while we, uh, yeah. Uh, I don't know if I have... I do have more seared bricks, though. We could... In theory, I can chisel this... With my, like, 20 chisels that I have. Somewhere. Put that in there for a second. And then... Tiered, chisel that into steered bricks. And then I, okay, I do have my ladders. Good. Okay, let's, let's expand this. Give me one minute to expand this and we'll be right back. Alrighty, guys. So we got our Electrum cooking up here. 800 plus blocks. I mean, yeah. It's, yeah, literally insane. So many, so much electrum. That's 7,000 right there. Like, wow. Wow. And I just realized I need the smeltery. Crap. <laughs> I clearly didn't think this one through. Actually, hold on. We do have mana glass. Hold on. We do have mana glass. We made it. I believe two episodes ago. So we're good for now. Thank God. And then we take that. Oh, we need the crystals. Right. Uh, which crystals do we need for this? All of them. <laughs> Seems legit. We need all the freaking crystals. All of them and their freaking mothers. God damn it. I mean, it's not that difficult to make them, so I'm not surprised. I will go ahead and dump those in there. I mean, we're going to need them eventually, but yeah, let's go ahead and let me uh, get a couple, like a stack of each of these crystals and we will be back. Alrighty, guys. So, we got our crystals, which is all you. Alright, I didn't need the video crystals. Good to know. Uh, we just need to do this now. Mm, and I left my Electrum over at the home. The home space. Electrum, boys. We've got it. We got it. So, that's going to be that. And that should technically be the first quest done for Thomcraft, or at least in the book. No, we need observation fundamation uh, foundation. Oh, so that's just probably doing a little bit of scanning. Right. Just scanned a bunch of stuff. So let's go ahead and check to see if that was it. Yep, that was it. Perfect. So they wanted us to scan stuff. So now we need to do this. Discovery. And they want us to make a crucible. So to make a crucible, we're actually going to need this smeltery again. I don't think iron and electrum mix. So we should be good to go. 
It's a, a very uncertain remark. Yes, we're good. I guess I can borrow this one. Oh no, jet. One too many. I'm sorry. One too many clicks. You can go back to being on and doing your thing. Okay. G, G, my friends. Yeah, these should all be full by now. Yeah. So we've got a fair amount of uh, creosote oil just uh, sitting in the background for right now. Uh, that will be used quite literally later. All right, so now we need to make a crucible. So we need our sales Mondays. And then... Where the fuck? Um, I left them inside the chest. I was like, where did my my plates go? Like, hello? Like, can can we not like hijack my plates? That would be great. And now we can go back over to our Thumbcraft area. Uh, this is actually gonna need a fire under it. So we're gonna go ahead and go get some nether rack. Some nether rack. And a flint and steel. I don't think I've been to the nether yet. So we also need to do that as well. That's something that we need to do. Something that we can work on. I just need a piece of steel. A piece of steel, not five pieces of steel. Or 20 billion pieces of steel. A piece of steel. A nice good old trusty old flint and steel. Steel? I think this is like broken. It's a broken recipe. There we go. So weird. That was really weird. And me no likey. Me no likey weird. Set that on fire. Put the crucible there or the, the cauldron. Right click it with Salus Mondes. Bob's your uncle fan. Bob's your uncle. Bob's your uncle fan. Yeah, on. We have ourselves a beautiful cru crucible. Crucible. There we go. That's going to get us that, which now we need Percantio. How have I already gotten Percantio? Uh. I think I need to make Okay So I guess another thing that we're going to need over here Is an infinite water supply So let's get that Going Uh FPS Game Is the game still alive? Yes, it should be. Um, blocks. I need to figure out what I need to do next. I have two buckets for that, and I believe the table. Yeah, the table needs other things, which we're gonna work on, right? To get the research table. Let's actually do it on this side. So it's more closer to the crucible. Right? Actually, nope, move it over one. I want there to be a gap in between. There's gotta be a gap. And then you, you, infinite source. You. And then we want this. So. Right, we decided that we wanted eyes of Ender for this. 
Uh, so let's just get a bunch of that, I guess. Out of curiosity, the the amulet, this, what is stopping us from making this amulet? Because we can totally make this right now. Like, for real. And that's going to be... How many of those am I going to need? Well, you get eight for this. So four, eight, so six buckets. One, two... Three, four, four, five, six. Right, yeah, we're gonna need a couple of buckets. That's gonna need some stone. So I'll just go ahead and do it. Eight, and then 16. And then the dark matter plates, we can easily get. Come over here, switch this to this, and we need five plates. And that should be an Evertide amulet, right? Oh, I think it's because we didn't have the, the extreme crafting yet. So that's why we hadn't made it. But yeah, perfect. Now I don't have to use water buckets for that. And or Britannia either, which is super nice. I actually might make a second one of those, to be fair. Can I fill these with this? Yeah, I might make a second one. One, two, three, four, five, six. I want a second one so I can automate Batania. Mm hmm. Or somewhat automate it. That means I'm going to need more dark matter. Uh, yep. Yeah. I have more of those. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Um, yeah, I'm getting really distracted. All right, so now we have that for Britannia for later. Um, right. I'm going to want. Oh, I need quartz slivers. I think I need that re research don't I basic alchemy research where's basic alchemy infusion oromancy artifice theory crafting ah this so does that unlock that now good G GG boys that was very easy actually and then I came back also for the eyes as well. Bombcraft. So we technically don't need this anymore. This is basically pointless now. Because I can right click. Uh. Oh, I didn't, I didn't bring the quartz slivers. Let's see. Quartz slivers. And also bring a chest. Oh, you know what, guys? Also, too, this unlocks, we just unlocked chest upgrades as well. We can upgrade our chest now. I can do that easily. Uh, where's my thing? Come on. That's what I'm looking for. That's how you do it. Is a lot. All right, I think it's 
empty now. Uh, do you tell me? No. That means we're gonna have to make the Googles. The goggles are revealing. Which we need artifice for that, discovering artifice. Which is fine. That's not what I wanted to do. And we're already making a mess. So seems freaking legit. All right. All right, so we have the, what, well, we have 15. We only need, I believe four for right. Yeah, four for the craft. So yeah, we're good there. All right, so the next hard part, I should have left all the thumb, thumb craft stuff over here, except for the four crystals that I need. All the thumb need of crafties. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and need just a little bit of things. So for you, we're gonna need you, which is gonna need quite a bit of things. Uh, let's get some string, some more mana string. All right. We're gonna have to automate this. All right, and that will get turned into the cloth. All right, so we don't need the cloth, but we need all of these things, which I think I actually have all of those. So we should be good. We might need a couple of things. So let's see, mana emerald we have. We need the mana red alloy which we also have. We have mana steel. We have a mana pearl. Mana diamond we don't have, but we can get that. And we also have mana lapis. And so we're just missing mana diamond, which is just easy. It's a, it's a diamond. It's a diamond. In the mana pool. Dude, I actually might set up another one of these. So that way we have, like, you know what I mean? We have a bit of to go off of. All right, let's go ahead and get our, our stuff back. This is super exciting. Uh... You, I wanted the forest and my living rock. All right, that's actually gonna take a, a decent amount of mana on the pools. So yeah. All right, once we get that, All right, we're ready to go. Uh, we just need a bottle of mana and a Sailor's Mondes. Uh, I think I actually cooked up a lot of glass too. So that is something that we have already uh, ready to go. I think. Didn't we cook up? Oh, you know what? We might have lost it all. Because remember when we had that creeper explosion? Like, uh three or so episodes ago. Yeah. Also, oh, yeah. Um, never mind. Forget it. All right, let's just, I guess, you know, we'll just cook up. Uh, I need more coal. I'm gonna do this real quick. So I can just pick and get it all cooked up. Get it all ready to go. Get it primed. Get our furnaces primed. We actually might make more of those. 
just saying. You know what? I'm actually going to divide the load. Because if I don't, it's going to be... Wait, did I just... Oh. No, I did. I just didn't take the stone out. Yeah, we need to find a place to store all the stone. Because this is a lot of stone. Like, this is a lot. I guess right next to the immersive chest will be fine. Alright, beautiful. We got glass cooking up. I don't technically need this obsidian anymore, so I'm just gonna that real quick. Just yeet it out of existence. Uh, this shouldn't be too difficult. So now we're gonna go ahead and grab bottle of mana. All right, bottle of mana, Silas. So you, you, and then. You want mana dust and then your four pretty shield crystals and that is a rune of mana boys that is a rune of mana oh my god and also we're just slightly or maybe a lot over time but that's okay uh you know it is what it is but you know i just wanted to get this done so next episode we can go ahead and straight away get right into uh terra steel crafting and hopefully get the elementium portal going but also in between episodes i actually might add um a little bit more uh mana to our mana batteries uh we'll see what we end up doing here so we can go ahead and do that and get ourselves a beautiful rune of mana and that's what i like to see but with that being said, guys, if you guys did enjoy today's episode, please do me a huge favor. Smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, ding dong that notification bell. Become a part of the Hunter's Tribe as we are trying to get to 250 subscribers. I would greatly appreciate it. With that being said, also, if you haven't followed me on Twitch, I stream there six days a week from 9 a.m. till 5 p.m. But recently, I've been just on the grind and I've been doing 14-hour streams, 80-hour weeks. But with that being said, again, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I greatly appreciate all of you and love all of you. With that being said, I'm going to love you. I'm going to leave you. Till next time.